Today we will talk about Lewy body dementia, also known as dementia with Lewy bodies, which is the third most common type of progressive dementia after Alzheimer's disease and vascular dementia. This form of dementia is due to protein deposits called Lewy bodies, which develop in nerve cells in the brain regions involved in thinking, memory, and movement, and cause lesions resulting in similar symptoms as in Parkinson's disease. It is worth mentioning that some patients may have elements from both Lewy body dementia and Alzheimer's disease, and this is named mixed dementia or dementia multifactorial. First, let's see the history of the disease. It was discovered by Frederick Henry Louis, who was born in Berlin, Germany, on January 28, 1885. He was trained in Berlin and Zurich and graduated from Berlin in 1910. Louis worked in the Alois Alzheimer lab in Munich and was partners with Hans Gerhard Grutzfeld, Alphonse Maria Jacob, and Ugo Zerletti. In 1912, Frederick Henry Louis found the bodies, and seven years later, Konstantin Nikolaevich Tretyakov is the person who recognized the relationship between Louis bodies and Substantia Nigra. He was the one who named these bodies with the name Louis. Louis later left Nazi Germany, immigrated to the USA in 1933, and died in Haverford, Pennsylvania on October 5, 1950, at the age of 65. Let's examine now what Lewy body dementia is. Lewy body dementia is a disease associated with abnormal deposits of a protein called alpha-synuclein in the brain. These deposits, called Lewy bodies, affect chemicals in the brain whose changes, in turn, can lead to problems with thinking, movement, behavior, and mood. The most common symptoms include changes in cognition, movement, sleep, and behavior, unpredictable changes in concentration, attention, alertness, and wakefulness, visual hallucinations, as seeing things that are not present and are typically realistic and detailed, such as images of children or animals, non-visual hallucinations such as hearing or smelling things that are not present are less common than visual ones but may also occur. Patients may also experience a condition in which a person seems to act out dreams while asleep. It may include vivid dreaming, talking in one's sleep, violent movements, or falling out of bed. People with Lewy body dementia can also experience orthostatic hypotension, urinary incontinence and constipation, and behavioral and mood symptoms such as depression, apathy, anxiety, and aggressive behavior. Lewy body dementia is a progressive disease, meaning symptoms start slowly and worsen over time, resulting in need of greater care assistance. How quickly symptoms develop and change varies greatly from person to person, depending on overall health, age, and severity of symptoms. Diagnosis of the disease is based on a detailed medical history, general blood tests, vitamin B12 levels, and thyroid-stimulating hormone test. MRIs and CAT scans are also necessary, along with scintigraphy of basal ganglia, by the DET scan method. While Lewy body dementia currently cannot be prevented or cured, some symptoms may respond to treatment for a period of time. A comprehensive treatment plan may involve medications, physical and other types of therapy, and counseling. Certain medications that can be used to ease some symptoms include anticholinesterases such as erivastigmine, donepezil, and galentamine. Antipsychotic medicines such as quetiapine, olanzapine, and risperidone, as well as antiparkinsonic medicines called carbidopa levodopa. Another significant factor in the disease is a balanced diet consisting of a variety of foods, limited in saturated fat and high sodium, reduced of salt and refined sugar, and continuous hydration. Based on global statistics, Lewy body dementia affects 20% of all dementia cases and concerns 0.7% of the population above the age of 65. 
If you want to be part of a wider scope to inform and interact with professionals worldwide regarding matters relating to the challenges of dementia and other related diseases and handling suggestions, just subscribe, click like and hit the bell to become part of the Memory Team and Community, a wider community with an excellent purpose.